So you had Carol Shelby sitting down in the flip top Cobra. Right. Did anyone realize the significance of what he was sitting in at that time? Yes and no. We knew it was a you know a one off, a prototype, um, but didn't really understand how special that car was. And the irony is, you know, I looked at the car then, I looked at the car years later, and now it sits and it's you know probably my favorite car. Yeah, for people who don't know, it's just outside it's, the studio. Yeah, I bought it a few years ago, and and we restored it, and you know, just it is a awesome piece of history. It's kind of where Ford versus Ferrari starts. It was the last car Miles and Remington built. Uh, it was really the last Cobra that Miles raced before he went to the GT40 program, and it was the most cheated up Cobra they ever built to beat the Grand Sports. And it was basically a Daytona Coupe chassis. That motor was out of uh, one of the Daytona Coupes that went to Le Mans, the all-aluminum FE motor. It was just the trickest, fastest, lightest Cobra they ever built. And then Ford said, you're done racing Cobras. You're on the GT40 program. Right. Yeah. Yeah. And, and, and the look of it, like it's longer. It's got a custom body on it. Like it is... It's different than any other Cobra. There's not one part that fits from a regular Cobra onto that car. Right. And there's Shelby just sitting S in it. Sitting in it, and 20 years later, yeah. it sits in the showroom here. That's cool. Yeah. 